Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you a 10 minute at home workout for your lower half of your body. This video is a part two to the other 10 minute workout that I have on my channel, I'll link it down below. If you guys wanna try out that video first, I recommend that you do so, because I'm not gonna lie, this one is tougher. But everything that you guys are about to see, you guys can cut down the moves, or you guys can even increase it by adding a resistance band or weight to your workout. So adjust this workout to your body and push the limits. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to share with anybody. And quickly, before we continue, I wanna introduce myself for anybody that is new here. My name is Cindy Flores, and on my channel, I share my Kindy transplant journey, as well as testimony, travel vlogs, lifestyle videos, workout videos, and so much more. So if you are new, definitely consider subscribing. For our first minute, we are going to do squat jumps, and this is gonna include a little bit of cardio, and I always like to start out with some type of cardio because this is really gonna get your heart rate up, and always start out strong. I do get tired midway of this workout, but push as much as you can, and then as you like exhort yourself, then start to slow down your move. Workout, we are going to do hip raises. Make sure you squeeze your glutes so you can really engage it. For our next workout, we are going to be doing hip raises as well, but this time we're going to be lifting up a leg. You can choose whatever leg you please, we will be targeting both of them. Now switching to the opposite side. For 
our next workout, we are going to do squats and kickbacks. Our next workout we are going to squat and then lift our leg to the side you can start with whatever leg you please first because we will be switching legs so if you guys notice I'm kind of sitting into the kickback this will also engage your core because you're gonna need that core strength to pull up your leg and you're gonna feel all the workout basically on the leg that is stable that is holding you down Now we are going to switch to the opposite side. next workout we are going to be doing scorpion kicks and we will be kicking twice on each side alternating Now let's finish strong with the wall sit. Make sure your legs are at 90 degrees and you are staying low. You will notice that I begin to move my arms because I'm kind of trying to distract my mind from the pain in my legs.
stuck around all the way to the end, congratulations because this workout was not easy. Hey.